hello guys welcome once again this is tech pba thanks for joining me in this video i will take you through how to resolve an issue with uh, any desk application so sometimes when you try to connect to uh, a remote computer using the any desk application you get this very error message and then most of the time you have to wait a number of seconds usually 20 seconds or sometimes even a thousand seconds before um, you can proceed to connect to the remote computer which can be very frustrating so i tried using the any desk on my pc to connect to this um to a remote computer and then i got the error message and then in this case i have to wait 20 seconds before i can proceed to connect to the remote computer so what we're going to do to resolve this issue is to um, press the windows key r on your keyboard to open the run dialog box and then in the run dialog box you are, you are, we are going to type appways.cpl to open the programs and features windows or the add and remove um, programs windows select any desk click on install and then over here you're going to select the remove configuration files very important you need to select that and then click the uninstall option to remove the application click ok on this window to remove the application completely from your pc so now it's been removed completely from the pc and then we need to reinstall the application if you don't have it uh, downloaded go ahead and then download it from um, google and then um, install it so I, I already had it in my downloads folder so i'll double click on it and then click the install any desk on this local machine click accept and install to proceed with the installation of the any desk application and then just wait for it wait for the application to install on your pc and then you will see the welcome screen click on the new session tab and then enter the remote computers address in the address bar and then click the connect icon to connect to the remote computer so you can see that um this time we didn't get that error message i set up unattended access on the on the remote computer so i, I will just type the the password to connect to it the unattended password and then once that is correct when you click ok it should connect to the remote computer successfully so yes guys kindly click on the subscribe button down this video to support us to bring you more of such videos and to grow this community together click the like button if this was helpful share the video turn on notifications for all and then i will see you guys in another video bye for now